Hello, and thanks for joining us for this video case tip series on how the Affordable Care Act impacts everybody. I'm Bryn McBride of ABC for Health. Today, we're reminding you of the anti-discrimination policies written into the Affordable Care Act. Now, the law contained a lot of important language that prohibits discrimination on the basis of race, color, national origin, sex, age, disability, and this applies to any health program. It's centered on programs that receive federal funding, so state Medicaid programs, navigator programs, tax programs related to the Affordable Care Act, but it actually has a little bit broader approach as well. It's also gonna impact the delivery of health benefits by insurance companies. Insurance companies cannot discriminate in the provision of health insurance and coverage. This includes not just refusing to offer coverage or canceling or limiting coverage, but it also impacts the marketing of coverage. It reaches into many different facets of the insurance industry. Repeal of the Affordable Care Act would get rid of this kind of consumer protection and anti-discrimination language. Now the anti-discrimination language is championed by different communities, those that fight for um, equal language and cultural awareness access in different policies, but also groups like the transgender community, where there are actually specific call-outs in the anti-discrimination laws that says that different hospitals and programs have to serve all people regardless of gender or gender transition. It's very powerful language, it's very encompassing, and advocates were happy to see it included in the Affordable Care Act, and they don't want to see it go away. Maybe you have an Affordable Care Act story you'd like to share. You can click on that information button and send us an email or visit our website at healthwatchwisconsin.org and tell us your story. Thanks for joining us.